Okay, guys, I'm going to do a simple recharge of the LTO. You can see I'm at 126 volts. This is the coil I just uh, did the video of with the excessive output because the coils are aligned in the proper direction in the proper manner uh, to add to the effect. So um, I'll turn this on. You can see 126.0. One twenty six point eight nine and going like crazy. So this is the properly configured coil, uh, both quarter wavelength and half wavelength on the combined bi filler and mono filler coil uh, secondary. So uh, one hundred twenty seven point two. It charges the LTO just unbelievably well. And uh, we're pulling about, uh, we're at 23.2, pulling one and a half amps. We're probably pulling about maybe three amps-ish at uh, 23 volts. So, you know, 75 watts or so, uh, you can see the LTO is charging. Again, 132 volt pack at 15 amp hours, 127.4. And this is only half of the coil. The other half is, uh, I'm going to build it. This is the second coil I've built. I've just um, uh, built this one so I could show you uh, how, it's, how it's built and how and why it operates in the manner that it does. So 127.5. Now, if you could imagine, I took this design, I scaled it up silver-plated copper pipes ran either uh, a Freon or a, uh, a coolant or water inside of the pipes. I scale this up to the bigger one or even bigger one and uh, you know larger battery here, larger battery here, big inverter over there and all of a sudden we're gonna have a whole lot of power especially when this pack is 500 volts and it's putting out tremendous amount of energy at a wicked, wicked high frequency. So uh, this coil does produce some heat uh, in the conversion process, but uh, really it's just the knowledge of the coils and how they interact. And as you can see, 127.7, and we really haven't been pulling that much power enough like not a joke i'm building a second uh, pack so that it can run a little longer and uh but still the driver has been sp spectacular um yeah you know it is what it is and uh when the coils are aligned in the right manner the uh output results are just so impressive so uh we'll let it go for another maybe another minute and you can get a feel of how quick this little device can recharge these big batteries and uh, in fact they do really well so 127.8 volts we'll, uh, we'll turn the machine off about one, 127 volts ish 126.9 maybe uh, what can I say simply awesome Ciao.